It's not cold. <laughs> I swear. This is my channel. I don't know what the fuck that was. Who she is. I don't know. She don't represent the Mimi channel over here. Okay. <laughs> but hey, you guys, Mimi here, and I'm back with another video. And today we gonna be talking about. All right, this is story time. As you see by the title, honestly, let's be real here. If you knew me during middle, well, no, no one really knew me. I ain't had no friends really. So, like the people that I told, I guess about the shit. Like, if you know, you fucking know, bitch. Like. School life, I fucking hate it. I don't understand how people are like, oh my gosh, I wish I could go back to school. Like, and you know how um, teachers and shit are like, you're gonna miss it. You're gonna miss it. You're gonna miss it. Bitch, I ain't missing shit. I am so fucking happy. I feel blessed and less stressed. Way less fucking stressed. Stressing about dumb school fucking assignments. And fucking just bullshit. Okay? No, no. I'm good. Just fine. Do not miss it. Like, there's nothing that I really truly Besides, like, the little baby friends that I did make, so. Not even. Like, I still talk to, so. Wait, wait, wait. Before I even get to the video or even tell you what the video is about, because I never tell you guys. Um, basically, please like <laughs> and please subscribe for the bullshit antics that I, I always fucking had to deal with at these fucking schools. Because, yes, oh yeah, by the way. If you ever want to hear ranting and yelling and just, mm, you will have to click, click the fuck out because bitch, I'm 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 ready, I'm ready. <laughs> like yo, honestly, this has been years in the making. I have been like just waiting to like start posting about this, and here it is. Honestly, I was gonna come on here and like not should I? I don't know how to start this. Okay, I'll just tell you, I'll start by telling y'all like what this is about. As you see by the title, this is how I got suspended for being bullied. Doesn't even like, fucking make sense. It literally fucking happened. And yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> okay, let's be real here. Okay, if you know me, I'm the most sweetest human being on fucking earth. Especially like back then, I was way fucking sweeter. Way fucking sweeter than I should have been. No. Oh. I was a little bit of an asshole when it was needed, but yeah. So basically, this was around middle school times. You feel me? Like, yeah. I just I don't know what the fuck it was. Like elementary school and middle school, I was just beating bitches' asses. I never lost a fight. Not to brag or anything, but I never fucking lost a fight. And yeah, it was just um. I don't know why bitches thought it was cute to fucking fight. I never liked fucking fighting. Ever. I never fucking liked it. Never liked it. I was one. Like, I beat bitches' asses. I got my anger out. But, fuck is we fighting for, bitch? You're mad because I have fucking hair. And, that's it. Like, that's literally what it used to be about. Like, literally, bitches would make fun of me and say my hair was a wig. I wish I had my hair out so I could like pull it. <laughs> like, yeah, I almost fucked my bun up to um, like start pulling my hair. But no, like, <coughs> the fuck crickets, bitch. Because even if my hair was a wig, but y'all bitches was wearing weaves and shit because y'all was bald headed. No shame to bald headed bitches, but like, y'all was bald headed and you was mad about it. Like, I don't know what to tell y'all. Like, how are you mad at me? Because my hair, like, it's good. And my hair, sister, my older sister's a hairdresser, so you're just mad because my shit's done every fucking week. Like, it was done every fucking week. But, like, yeah, like, it's just, like, you were literally mad because my hair is fucking done every fucking week, bitch. You're tired. So... And this is like one of the, just one of the baby things. 
Like, I'm not even gonna get into the things that these bitches used to fucking do to me for no fucking reason. Like, oh my gosh. Like, I just don't, I don't get it. Like, uh, I'm gonna give y'all the story time of when I gave this bitch a swirly and like upcoming videos because like I just need to like start throwing these videos the fuck at y'all because after this one I feel like y'all are gonna be like me y'all have to fucking <laughs> you have to cause fucking continue this shit because what the fuck like if you look at me look at my channel if you know me bitch you're like what the fuck because I was like what the fuck yes uh, yes okay so mm -hmm. honestly I don't know which fight this happened with i used to get oh yo oh my gosh i literally used to get suspended like okay boom i'll get suspended for 10 days leave come back boom suspended that day straight up 10 days 10 days and usually these bitches would get like three to five days and i would get the 10 what the fuck and then i would start the fight the fuck so I got to a fight. This is like one of my last fights. Wait, was it my last fight? One of my last fights. And I don't even know what the fucking fight was about. Like, I really don't know. I wish I wish I could just go into my school records and like just see all the fights that I was in, even though they fucking lied on every fucking record. Because listen here, I was like the shy quiet. I wasn't fucking shy. I was quiet. I didn't want to talk to you motherfuckers. If y'all are watching and you're from like my school and I'm posting this video on Facebook and like all my social medias so I'm pretty sure y'all motherfuckers are gonna see it y'all gonna be like hmm because we went to the same school y'all gonna be fucking nosy and be like hmm I know exactly what you fucking talk about and I remember bitch if you if I didn't like you you didn't like me and you see this fucking video you can suck my dick yeah and like it was just like y'all are weird to the motherfuckers that wasn't weird, which was minimal of y'all, but y'all were there, minimally. Whoop the fucking do, hi. And if we're friends, oh, okay. Hey, you already know the deal. It's just like, mind your fucking business, okay? okay? I'm gonna just go dive into the part of when, like, I got fucking in trouble because I can't remember the fight. So I'm just skip to the part where I got in trouble. And my mom had to come to the school. It was always a thing where they called my mom and she came to the school. Like, what these bitches do to you now? What the fuck? Like, I'm sorry I did your hair so well that they're fucking with you again. Like, I don't like, I don't know. Like, I'm sorry that you look good. You are good. You're that bitch. Like Literally, every time I would get into a fight, y'all bitches don't know. Like, y'all was giving me, like, good times with my mom. Every time we would leave, I would go get some McDonald's after I fought. And I would go to the fucking corner store right next to my fucking house. And I would get snacks and chips and chill with my mother for the rest of the fucking day. So, thank you. I beat your ass because you were a hater. And then I got rewarded with it with snacks because I beat your ass. Because if my mom seen that I lost, it was problems. And I never lost, so it was never problems. It was rewards. Basically, like, thank you for, like, letting me leave school early to not have to deal with y'all bitches. Like, you got your ass beat, and I got food, and I got McDonald's. Like, the fuck? Especially as a kid, that's blessed. I beat your ass, and then I get McDonald's? Come on. Okay. Let's go. And it wasn't like I was trying. Y'all bitches was mad. Y'all bitches was haters. And I will like, I at the time, I didn't understand it. I thought it was like, oh, like, I'm not good enough. Well, I mean, at the beginning, I was, it just didn't make sense. Cause like, you know, as a kid, you're like, the fuck? You know, people try and people blame you. So then you start thinking, okay, yeah, it's me, that's the problem. But then my mom was like, no bitch, we're going to McDonald's. They're weird. You have nice hair. They're haters. And like now, obviously, I realize that I have nice hair still. And y'all bitches are still bald headed. Nothing wrong with bald headed bitches. But y'all is mad because y'all are bald headed. And that is that. Like, that is that. Like, the fuck? Right? That's literally all it was. Like, you were mad because you're bald headed. Okay. Mad ass. That's why I got McDonald's. 
Eating all your bitches. Eating all your bitches. Eating all your bitches. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Oh, right. It's crazy. I love my mom because she just never went with the bullshit. Like, you know, usually a lot of parents, because I have a black parent. You know, black. a lot of black parents are like, oh, you in trouble? What the fuck did you do? Why did you do this? No, my mom was like, what the fuck did they do? Why the fuck are they calling me for this bullshit? Because they would call my mom every time they fucked with me. And it was a lot. Like, literally, it was to the point where I just was like, alright, y'all, this is not about to fuck with me. I'm just about to stay home at this point. Like, I did not give a fuck, like, about school or nothing. Like, I didn't care. Like, I stood home. So, it wasn't that I was scared. I just didn't care. <laughs> um, these bitches just, like, was weird. So, I was like, alright, I'm staying home. <laughs> and literally, it, get, it got to the point where, like, you know how, like, if you miss X, Y, Z days, like, you know... <laughs> They start calling the police and shit, and they tell you you have to go to school because you have to fucking have a certain amount of days to go to school, which is fucking, okay, it's not dumb because, you know, you have to go to school, but, like, it's fucking dumb because, like, I didn't want to go. <laughs> they call my mom, I'm there, you know, sitting there, like, they, it was always so weird because they would just tell me that I was in trouble, and, like, they would never let me explain myself. They will be like, okay, you did this, you're in trouble. You have 10 days. And that's it. That's all. I never, ever, 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 ever. And I'm not joking. Like, I'm not exaggerating. I never, ever got to explain my side of the story of why these bitches was bullying me. Like, I had a counselor. I never went to fucking counselor because they never fucking cared. So, like, they would be like, okay, if you have a problem, talk to me. And I'm like, no, because once I talk to you, literally it happened. Once I talk to the motherfuckers, I would get in trouble. How am I getting in trouble for these bitches bullying me? Like, it was just weird. So, I would go, I would just not go and tell motherfuckers when this shit was happening. So, I would just let the shit build up, build up, build up, build up, build up. Oh, and mind you, when these bitches, when I fought these bitches, like, I never threw the first hit. They would try and hit me. But then I was, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, just, <laughs> these bitches was like, <laughs> you feel me? Like, no, bitch. Like, I'm not gonna let you hit me. Like, but I'm gonna, like, let you, you know, throw the first swing. You feel me? Like, that's what's gonna happen. You know? Okay. That, yeah. Also, my mom told me that. Don't hit these bitches first, because why are you hitting these bitches? Even though I still got in trouble first. <laughs> and longer, so. Didn't matter. <laughs> so, my mom comes in, blah, blah, blah. It's so crazy, like. And that's another thing. When, every time they brought my mom in, they will always be like, okay, Tania's in trouble for X, Y, and Z. She's like, okay, like, y'all are some whack-ass motherfuckers. I don't know why you're letting my daughter just, like, get fucking terrorized, not listen to her. Let me see the fucking tapes of what fucking happened because they will always love to be like, yeah, we have your daughter on tape. We have your daughter on tape doing X, Y, and Z, but we would never see the tapes. We would never see the tapes. We would never see the tapes. Even with these glasses, we would never see the tapes. Like, where the fuck are they? Nowhere to be found because there was no fucking tapes because they're fucking liars. And even if they did have tapes, it would show that I wasn't the problem. <laughs> Or where bitches fought me, there were no cameras. Like, obviously. I fought bitches in bathrooms and, like, you know, weird written corners in, like, places where it just didn't. Like, half the time, because I fought so much, like, like, not every place is going to have a fucking camera in the fucking school. You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't fucking know. That just weren't there. You know, they're, and they're cheap as fuck. So, cheap ass high school. So, not high school. Cheap ass fucking middle school and elementary school. So, like, you know what I mean? I'll never show the fucking tapes. So my mom would just like cuss them out and like I'd get in trouble for no fucking reason and I'd go home and get McDonald's and snacks and chill. So yeah, like it was just uh, so okay, okay I forgot. Getting to the me getting suspended for being bullied. So like it just kept happening, 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 happening. It was just like, I guess I got to a certain like amount of times getting into trouble to get like expelled or whatever. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna say I got expelled instead of suspended because I literally had to leave the school. It wasn't like me suspended from school. 
it was me like i had to go to a whole different fucking alternative school for no fucking reason and they were literally like yo as soon as i got there they're like why the fuck are you here they see my record they're like okay like you know like it adds up but then they see me in person and they're like the fuck why the fuck are you here they literally tried so hard to fucking get me back into the other school because it was just like why are you why the fuck are you here so because i was just so good because motherfuckers like i miss that school so much because the teachers were so nice because like it's an alternative school so like they are taught to like you know be like better i guess not better but like you know i feel like i, I just feel like the teachers there that like, i talked to i didn't meet every teacher but like they were just fucking nice you know what i mean like they like they knew they had different trainings for like different types of kids and like they just like i was like in that spectrum so like you know the bad kids they knew how to handle them even though i was a bad kid so it was like it was easy for me because i was chill like the only problem if the only time that you would have a problem with me if somebody made a problem with me you know they sure did have a fucking problem that's another story time for another time baby stay tuned turn the notifications on it's like no bitch no and i'm gonna finish the problem and the thing is i never like tried to fight these bitches they always wanted to fight me that's another thing it's just like ugh, whatever so like that's the only reason that i would ever get into a fight so yeah they just didn't understand why the fuck i was there so they literally tried to get me back into the book of school and yeah like, so i had to go to the alternative school and my mom was like, yeah, get my get my girl out of here. Like, y'all are just doing too fucking much. I don't know how that went. I don't know if, like, act. No, they didn't fucking ask my mom to fucking transfer me because, no. I mean, I'm pretty sure she would have said yes to make it better for me. But, like, they didn't fucking ask. They never asked. Like, it was never, like, an opinion for me. Like, I never got to say my piece ever. So, this is my piece. Honestly, these, ugh, it's so crazy. I hated every single one of these staff members in this fucking school because they never fucking listen and even the one side like y'all it pissed me off because there was one time right and they was like yeah okay i'll listen to you one time and i got it i think that was like the time that i like got suspended too so i was like okay and so i'm really not talking to y'all motherfuckers what the fuck weirdos like and it's not the fact that like you have me on my side but like if you get my side of the story, like, you know. It's the fact that these bitches at the school, they would come together and then, like, lie about me. Because it was, like, a whole group of bitches. And niggas. Niggas and bitches. Like, you know, like, the popular people that they... No, the, no, excuse me. Let me reiterate that one. The motherfuckers that thought they were cool and all stuck together with their weirdness. You know, the motherfuckers that would, like, take each other's boyfriend and, like, fucking lie on each other and fucking, like, just be weird as fuck. You know, those bitches. But they would stick together because they like friendship. Even though they weren't fucking friends at all. Like, no good friendships anywhere. Like, they thrived off of this, like, fucking being weird and mean to people. Like, that's the only thing that, like, kept them together, you know? So, yeah. And then, um, yeah, I got suspended. Like, there was no choice. It was like, alright, you gotta go bro you gotta go see you like you just like got in trouble so many times it just racked up like you gotta go bye so i was like okay i don't give a fuck like i'm out like i don't want to be with y'all motherfuckers so like i love that school when i was out i loved it honestly didn't want to go back so when i got suspended my mom cussed them out she was like where's the tapes where's the tapes where's the tapes there was never tapes never tapes never tapes she was weird so yeah and I literally, like, it was so, uh, so annoying because it was just, like, these bitches really, like, lied to the staff and, like, made me look like the bad guy when they were, like, the weirdos. And they used to do weird-ass shit to me. It was very much so weird. It's crazy because counselors would tell me, like, yeah, this person, this person, this person, out of the, all these motherfuckers that I did not fucking like. And the ones that fucked with me. Was all these people that like was saying that I was doing shit when they were the ones doing it to me. But they knew in their head like me I didn't give a fuck so I'm like okay fuck you like I'm gonna fight you if you want to fight like that's it. Like that's all. I'm not gonna fucking go tell on you cause that doesn't do shit but get me in trouble so. These bitches somehow didn't get in trouble and cause you know it was the ones that like you know 
knew the motherfuckers or some shit. And then they was kicking it with them and had a fucking rapport with them. So, like, they fucking listened, which was so fucking dumb. Because it's like, yo, how are you going to listen to, like, one type of story and, like, not even listen to the other side? It was weird. So, yeah, like, honestly, it was weird. I got sus expelled. Not suspended. I got expelled. I had to leave to a whole alternative school because these bitches bullied me. Like, it was very much so weird. And I will be telling more story times about this. I will be telling, like, very much so stories about how I beat these bitches' asses. I get bitch swirly. What these bitches do to me. Like, I'm sorry I'm talking so fast, but, like, these bitch, like, whoo. I don't, yo, I forgot her name. No, I'll be watching this girl, Ricky, and she be talking about, like, story times about beating these bitches up. And, honestly, it kind of, like, just, like, made me think about, like, all these fucking stories. Like, that I had and I forgot to fucking film. So like here it is. They're about to start rolling out. And I told y'all I wasn't going. I know I haven't posted. I for, I didn't like realize I missed like I kinda wanna start posting like at least once a week. So like I th I think I missed that mark, but like I'm like still here, you know what I mean? It's not like fucking months and months and months that Sean I get videos, you know? It's just it takes me a while to edit and fucking upload. So just gotta get it done basically. So yeah. These bitches is weird. like it's so fucking crazy. Like, but y'all will be getting these story times and like it's so funny. I don't know if I finished that tangent about Ricky, but like she literally be talking about these bitches and like she gets hyped. Yeah, I didn't finish that tangent. She gets hyped and like I was just like I'm just like this shit is like it's bringing me back. Like if a bitch came up to me and wanted to fight me about this shit, I'm just kidding. Nah, nah, nah. I don't know. I don't really fucking give a fuck. Anger just really does like come back. I think it's because I'm hot. <laughs> <laughs> bitch calm down this hot ass ring light and shit like okay okay but like honestly like it's just like all i want to say to these public schools is fuck east hartford high school fuck east hartford middle school for sure fuck all the fuck everything like fuck all public schools like seriously y'all suck ass y'all don't know how to talk to kids and y'all fucking are just trash. Like, y'all never dealt with my shit the correct way. Y'all lied. You kicked me out for no fucking reason. You would give the bitches less time when they would do more shit to me. And it was just weird. Y'all were weird. Y'all picked favorites and y'all was just weird as fuck. Y'all didn't give a fuck to, like, actually try and mediate shit. And when shit was trying to be mediated, I got attacked. So, fuck y'all. Suck my dick. I say the school that I went to, but East Hartford Middle School and my fucking elementary school, y'all can suck my dick. And East Hartford High School. I didn't fight in East Hartford High School, but, like, these bitches really just wanted to squabble with me. So, like, and, and I got in trouble for that. So, fuck y'all. Suck my dick. And, yeah. See y'all in the next video. Thank you guys for watching this fucking bullshit, like, story time with me just getting in trouble for no fucking reason. And, yeah, like and subscribe. One like equals one punch for these bitches. I just needed to get it. And <laughs> subscribe. One subscribe is for, like, me not getting in trouble. And, yeah, like the video if you like the video. And it's the come up. Gee! Right. I'll see you guys in the next video if I don't forget I fucked up the whole fucking setting okay thank god I did that at the end of the video okay bye see y'all like next week or maybe in a few days we'll see bye. I won't forget <laughs>